Hi there, I'm Angela Oberer, and I'm about to defrost my freezer. Can you see all this buildup? Well, after a while, it makes getting the food out of the freezer a pain. It's gotta be done, so let's just do it. Let's scoot the freezer out and unplug it so we're not dealing with live electrical currents, and this will help the freezer thaw out more quickly. Then you'll wanna grab a few coolers or bins to put your food in while you're defrosting the freezer. It's easy to sort the food as you go. All the frozen fruits in one bin, frozen meat in another, and so on. This will make finding food again easier as well. We've got a garbage can over here to toss all the outdated food in, and we have all of our frozen food over here ready to sort. So you can defrost your freezer just by letting it thaw out on its own, or you can use a hair dryer just make sure that you're not too close to the electrical coils and that your cord is not in any water that might drip. You can also use bowls of boiling water to create steam to hurry up the process. But today is a hot day and the freezer is in my garage, so we'll just let nature help us out. While the freezer is thawing, I will clean the shelves in the door and put all the frozen food back in the door. That way that's done and out of the way. Check to see if your freezer has a hose plug in the bottom. This you can hook up to a hose and run the hose through an open window and outside if your freezer's in the house. Mine's out in the garage, so we'll just wipe out the water. No big deal. And to hurry up the process so my food doesn't melt, I'll use this plastic spatula and cookie tray to scoop out the leftover ice. The plastic spatula will keep me from damaging the coils in the freezer. While the rest of the ice is thawing, I'll go through each bin of food and check to see what's inside. I have two coolers. The one in the back is for food our family can eat over the next couple of weeks. And the cooler in the front is the food that goes back inside the freezer. So with all this food, I don't have to go grocery shopping for a week or two. And I can save money by buying in bulk from stores like Costco and Sam's. Eat some now, freeze the rest for later. Once the freezer is thawed out, this is a good time to wipe down the freezer walls and check the door seal to make sure there are no leaks. Then it's time to put all the food back in, plug the freezer back in, and we're done. Once you have the coolers out, it's a good time to clean them and get them ready for the next use. So, now my freezer is clean and defrosted, and this will make my freezer run more efficiently, and that will save me money on my electrical bill. So, defrost your freezer on a regular basis because not only will it save you money on your grocery bill because you'll be able to buy in bulk, but it will keep your food fresh by rotating it out every so often. And that, my friend, is a good idea. It's a good idea.